This is going to be a relatively short video, not like my usual ones. But, unexpectedly, it was quite quiet this morning. I have my first visitor. Came in quite early, as you can tell. The camera's struggling. Doesn't waste any time. And it just runs away. Jay somehow managed to land on top of my feeder cam, but the Jays are not on the list. There's not too many in this area, so I'll leave them well alone. Again, I believe that this squirrel was the first squirrel. Because it's just come darting in, and like last time we ran away. It's just done the exact same thing again. But fortunately, this one has just sat up nicely for me. Not sure if it's the same one. I believe this might be a different one because it's quite a fatty. So we might be able to get ourselves off the mark now. So there's one down, camera was struggling a bit so I stuck it onto the night mode. Managed to get myself another. I believe that was the first one that was coming in and it finally came back for a third time. Time's moved on, you can see how much lighter it is now seen a squirrel coming in. I've had quite a lot of pheasants as well which are going underneath the feeder but I'm not allowed to shoot them at the moment there doesn't seem to be too many but for some reason there seems to be a lot underneath my feeder but it is what it is and it's nice to see that this squirrel is making its way up to the feeder Hopefully I'm going to get that opportunity where it'll grab a nut and it'll stay still long enough for me to get that shot placement onto it. that's this morning done. I'm going to have to apologise because this is a really short video and because I've only got three squirrels but then again that shows that I'm now on top of the squirrels in this area on this feeder so so yeah I'm going to leave this one probably until you know spring summer next year and yeah just a short video for this one hopefully there'll be a lot more next time hmm